Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what is the default timeout of Selenium WebDriver? Let me answer. The default timeout of Selenium WebDriver is zero. Why? Because Selenium WebDriver by default won't wait for any web element to be displayed on the page. Okay, if a particular web element on the page is uh, displaying on the page with a delay, then Selenium WebDriver is not going to wait for that element by default because the default timeout of the Selenium WebDriver is zero. Let me practically demonstrate this for you. So let's say I'll open this application URL, my.blogspot.com in the browser. And on this application page, there's a button. When you click on this button, these options, okay, this uh, Facebook, Flipkart, Gmail options are not coming immediately. Rather, they are getting displayed with a delay. Okay, after clicking drop down button, you see, after some time only, the Flipkart option is coming, let's say. So if I want the Selenium to click on the drop down button, it will click without any problem because drop down button is there. There without any delay, the drop down button is there on the page. So Selenium will be able to find the drop down button and will be able to click it. But after clicking on the drop down button, the flip card option, if you want Selenium to click on that, by default, Selenium will not wait for the flip card option, okay, which is coming with a delay and it will fail to click on the flip card option. Okay, it will try to click on the flip card option before the flip card option appears here because of which there, uh, there is an exception known as no such element exception will be displayed. Okay, will be occurring. Let me practically show you. For that, I'll open this Eclipse ID where some sample Selenium automation code is already written for opening the Chrome browser, for maximizing the browser window and for opening the application URL in the browser. After that, I would like to click on this drop down button. Let me inspect this drop down button. So it has a class locator. Copy this and write down driver dot find element by dot class name. Give the class locator name for that uh, drop down button and say dot click. So it will Selenium will be able to click on the drop down button without any problem. And after clicking on the drop down button, I want Selenium to click on the flip card, which will not be possible. Okay. Because by the time when Selenium try to, tries to click on the flip card, flip card option won't be there. Okay. It is a link text. You see, anchor tag link text. Copy this. Driver dot find element by dot link text. Give the link text locator of the flip card option and say dot click. For here, at this line, that is line 16, you will get no such element exception. So right click run as Java application. It will be able to click on the drop down button since Selenium WebDriver won't wait for the flip card option, which is coming with a delay. It's going to give you no such element exception in the output. This proves that, uh, this proves that, uh, this proves that Selenium WebDriver wait time is zero. Okay. Default timeout is zero. Okay. So fine. So how to overcome this problem? To overcome this problem, we have to use waiting mechanism. Okay, either implicit weight or explicit weight you can use. If you are going with implicit weight, you can do it here. Driver dot manage dot uh, time modes dot implicitly weight duration dot of seconds and give some seconds, let's say five seconds, etc. So this is a global weight which will be applicable for all the elements on the on the screen the script in the script. Okay. Now run the script. This time flip card option will be clicked because we have changed the default timeout of Selenium web driver. From zero to which we, we asked Selenium web driver to wait for at least five seconds. I mean five seconds max. Okay. See the flip card option came and uh, Selenium has wait for the wait, wait waited for the flip card option and has clicked on it. Okay. So uh, similarly, we can also implement the explicit waiting mechanism. So here we can also implement the explicit waiting mechanism like a uh, web driver wait wait is equal to new. Web driver wage, driver comma, duration dot of seconds, five seconds. Let's say the semicolon, import this web driver wage. And we are explicitly waiting for this flip card option with this uh, explicit waiting mechanism, waited until expected conditions dot visibility of element located by visibility of element located. You can give this by dot. Uh, We've got here, okay. And put a semicolon here at the end. That's it, okay. We are explicitly waiting for the flip card option to be displayed on the page. Maximum timeout is five seconds, okay. So we are changing the default timeout to this kind of customized timeout for this only one element that is flip card option, okay. This time, Selenium web driver will wait for the flip card option because of the explicit waiting mechanism and will be able to click on the flip card option.
After clicking on the drop down button, once the Flipkart option comes, Selenium Web Driver has waited and clicked on the Flipkart option. Okay. So, hope guys, uh, you understood uh, what is the default timeout of Selenium Web Driver. It is zero. Okay. So, to change that, we have to uh, use either implicit wait or explicit wait mechanism. Okay. In Selenium. So, that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.